Hello everyone, welcome to my videos on comics and toys and today we're looking at another exciting video on Transformers this time and it's the collectible figurines and 3D puzzle piece collector cards and I picked this up from Forbidden Planet today for $1.99 couldn't resist because it's very G1 and I've not seen these before so hopefully I will be able to get the set if there, there is a few out so I'm going to open this little bad boy up and see what's inside. Right, I am back and I'm about to put my fingers right in the slit of this toy. So this is a surprise to me as it is you. Let's see what we get. Let's try and get the card out first of all. Oh, there we are. That is Optimus Prime's feet. That's actually pretty cool actually. It's quite a good card. And on the back it's got the movie Ratchet version. So he can fuck right off fucking hate Michael Bay films doesn't count so we just keep looking at the prime card on the front there we are and here's the little booklet figurine checklist let's see who we got oh there's quite a few there oh my god there's fucking loads so we've got Optimus Prime, Megatron, Ratchet, Starscream, Soundwave, <coughs> Bumblebee, Shockwave, Ultra Magnus, Grimlock, and Hot Rod. Uh, the Transformers Prime cartoon, which I've just been watching, and if you haven't seen it, you should check it out because it's, uh, I think, probably the best Transformers cartoon that's ever been released. So I'll, I will put it up there with G1. G1's obviously <coughs> the best for. Uh, childlike memories that you used to watch when you're younger, but when you look back at it, the stories are a bit dodgy. But obviously, Transformers G1 is where it's all started, so they rule. But yeah, check out Transformers Prime. It looks like the movie that I hate, but it is fucking awesome. And it's got Peter Weller and Peter Weller, Peter Culling, and Frank Weller, who do the voices for Megatron and. Optimus, so you've got Megatron there, Ratchet, Starscream, Bulkhead, Bumblebee, who's probably the most annoying in it, Shockwave, who I can't remember being in it, Wheeljack, Soundwave, who's actually pretty crap in it, and in the Sectorcon, and the third lot is the Transformers movie figures, so they can go and do a flying fuck, as far as I'm concerned. But I imagine with my luck, I'm probably going to pick up one of the movie ones. So, there's the back of it. You can get the cards. You can make Megatron and Optimus old school pictures from the artwork. So, yes, yeah, be very cool. So, it'd be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 8, 9, 20. I would want out of this collection. So, without further ado, let's see who we get. Oh my god. Oh fuck's sake. What the fuck is that piece of shit? That is dog shit. And that is Ratchet, because I can tell by his stupid arms. So that is Ratchet from the movies. And I will not be keeping that because he sucks. Michael Bay, you can fuck off. And he's got a little stand of him as well. Sorry to disappoint you G1 fans, but we've got a shitty fucking movie Ratchet figure. But, I reviewed it for you guys. I'm willing to take the pain. There he is. I don't know what that looks like. It's like some old man with green all over him. So yeah, fuck that. Anyway, don't let me put you off this toy hopefully we can get some of the g ones and save the world and all will be okay so i've got a card of optimus prime's feet which counts yay there we go Let's put him in front of that so yeah this is a review for transformers blind packs hope you enjoyed it and i will see you very soon for hopefully a much cooler toy review